Today we're talking about a lot of things. Originally, this video was supposed to be about how I set up a new project in DaVinci Resolve and organize my media, but that would have literally been two sentences. So that video is coming when I have a little bit more to say about it. In the meantime, I can show you my folder structure and that I keep one project per month for now. But that's not what we're talking about. Today, we're talking about how fun it is to hang out with other creators. And that after much procrastination on my end, there is now a creator hangout every last Monday of the month. This last week, we talked about consistency and Justin really stole the show by crossing 200,000 followers on Instagram during the meetup. He was just under 3,000 a week ago. But this isn't a video about how consistency is the key to success. Because what I want to talk about is how I started bullet journaling again to improve my mental health. After being super focused in January, this last month was a lot messier. You know, the big theme for this year for me is to do things more regularly. And uploading on one channel once per week is manageable. But when you add a second one and possibly a third or a fourth while also planning a new D&D campaign, none of those things actually get done well. But I don't want to talk about that. And I don't want to talk about how I designed two pages in my journal as content calendar that can accommodate multiple channels. Because then you see all my secret plans I'm working on and I'd rather share them with you when they're ready. So that's not what this video is about. What I want to talk about is how I just got on a call with a super successful creator that I admire for a future collaboration and how I'm getting sponsors for a channel that has zero subscribers. But obviously that is even more top secret, so that's not what this video is about. So instead, let's talk about LinkedIn and how it is becoming more and more interesting to me as I'm looking for a place to publish written articles about specific creators, how they grow, and some interesting things going on in the creator economy. But the reality is that thanks to all my teachers, I still hate writing and definitely still think that I suck at it. So that's clearly not what this video is about. Instead, let's talk about how I got really excited when I saw an ad on Instagram for an online video conference right here in Vienna. I thought it was like a tiny VidCon and it looked like a great opportunity to grow my network. But then I realized this is squarely aimed at corporate marketers and a single day ticket costs 600 euros. So that's obviously not what this video is about. What I wanna talk about is how this focus on consistency is still a blessing and a curse. It absolutely pushed me to continuously create and worry less about a singles video performance but it leaves very little time for recovery and reflection. So I'm still not sure how I feel about it, and that's not what this video is about. What I wanna talk about is that sometimes you just have an off day or even an off week, but I try to still focus on what I can do with what I have to end up with something rather than nothing, because faulting just leads to resistance, which makes everything harder and builds frustration. So, I think this video is just about getting back to creating. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next week.